Hello everybody, it's your boy Mark here, and we're going to be hopping into some more Dreadout. Now, in the past episode, I spent a lot of time trying to find some stupid key from a stupid puzzle where you had to line up for the pictures. If you've seen the episode, you've seen it. If you haven't, check it out. Frustration at its finest. But, aside from that, see if we can keep going farther and, I don't know, get the keys from the boar. So without any further ado, let's just do that. Ah, so, we got the key from over there. So now I think we just gotta go to a locked door and open it, or go to the bathroom and wait for the boar to come back. That door's locked, so I don't think that's what's going on. Come on, boar pal. Come on, you hideous beast. Sorry, you're beautiful. We don't want to shame. <laughs> Who's, who am I kidding? You're a monster. You're quite literally a monster. A beast at best, but a monster for certain. Yeah, yeah, come on. Come on. Get your big butt over here. Hey. Fight. <laughs> Okay. Fine. Come on. What? Did I hurt you? I don't think I can open this. Yeah, that's boarded shut. But... Let's see. Anything in the notes? Ah, uh, kids jingling. Documents. This is it. Oh my oh, come gosh. On. That's ridiculous. I am I am upset. <laughs> I am so upset. Hey, I shut the hell up. <sighs> no, I don't want to cut across there. I want to cut across in the room that you do that in. But it's that small office room. That's where we gotta go. Yeah. This area. Of course we run out of stamina in this spot. Yeah, so this music is significant. As you see, it's like a door, right? Open it with the key. Bop, bop, bop. Whoop. That is creepy as hell. Okay. It's my favorite. That's the last scissors. Oh, it's the baby. I 
I don't want a haircut. I'm good. I'm good. fine I'm fine I'm just dead and then I will be back and I'll be fine just got messed with the baby the baby would be like and then I'll be like <gasps> and then the mom would be like <sighs> and I'll be like <laughs> actually that's a great thumbnail picture okay whoa I just ripped out my camera stand I mean my mic stand <laughs> such great vigor with that Running with scissors is not safe. Uh. Okay, this is not killing me softly. Okay, hmm, we're dead again. We're dead again. That's fine. That's fine. We got it. We got it. We just gotta like stop being little bitches about it. <laughs> they don't. They don't. I agree with that statement. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> they really don't do drugs. hurting me. <laughs> Suck it, Granny! That baby's mine! <laughs> I'm gonna drop kick that fucking baby, I swear. <laughs> Uh. <laughs> hmm. I found scissors. Guess what? That's probably gonna take what I need for that, right? You little shit. You. Ah. Piece of fucking garbage. Now we have a way to do with the big thing, right? Yeah, but we gotta get close to it. I don't know what trigger is it. To wake up and be aggravated, but oh, it's just sleeping. So that's the fast way out. They're like, no. Huh. Okay. Um. Lovely.
Um. Okay, we got a screaming thing behind us. of it but oh I definitely died hundred <laughs> percent well I didn't have a red vignette or at least that I know of maybe I'm just blind but like isn't it gonna start the sequence or said my ghostpedia was updated. What's that? Uh, Demet Loron. Hideous creature that was tasked to guard passed away ever since it was summoned. For years, it had been living its life in solitude, guarding its owner's secrets. Locked. 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 Okay, I guess that's where we're going to have to end this. So I'm going to off episode, off screen, figure out what the hell just happened and what to do next. But aside from that, if you like this episode, God damn it, Scissor Phantom. What was their bio about? A high school principal who was driven mad by grief over his deceased baby. Later in life, he adopted a doll to replace his child. Then he protects even in death. He can be seen guarding a secret room nursery, a place designed to be safe for his baby from the threat of Kuntilanak, uh, an entity believed to be responsible for his child's death. Wait, so that's a man? I swear, that sounded like some female screams to me, but... Just gonna have to end the episode here. I hope you all enjoyed it with all the various weird things we have to do. But aside from that, if you did, please like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell to know when I upload next. And aside from that, I hope you all are having a good morning, noon, night, whatever it is for you. And yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Toodles.